All right guys, welcome to the next video here. And this is a continuation to Intro to Markup where we went over this guy here, this pattern, and we marked up this soap. So this soap is all marked up to this pattern, but there's a bit, uh, there's some differences with each pattern, right? So we'll get, we're gonna go over each one of those. Here we have a flute, we have a saddle, and we have a complex complete triangle at the end, okay? So the difference between, the main huge difference, I guess, between this one and uh, the incomplete triangle here is the fact that you only have one carving at one end here, you only have a flute, and it's a shallow flute, right? Um, and it's small, and you have no notch like you do here. You have a notch out here, and you have a flute here with this guy. This saddle's really small, and then we have this complete triangle at the end, so this is a complex end piece, okay? So, if we were doing the complex end piece, as I said before, you have 13 here, 13 here, this one crossing over would also be 13, okay? We look at our markup, we're taking this across from the um, middle point here, three up, three mils up, that's our line that we're gonna take across to one side, take across to the other side, connect it, okay? And then connect it to the center line that we have on the other side here, just like that. And then here and here, okay? So connecting all those lines to make the triangle. All right, so the difference between these two is with this guy, as you can see, well, first of all, it too is a notch. It's a triangular notch, it's not a slope. Like this guy's, this guy's a slope, right? It's a slope square, so we'll get to that in a sec. So all you're gonna do is you're gonna carve out, as I'll show you in, in the next videos, you'll carve out each side, and in this one, you'll just leave this one side, okay? So that's the only difference with the, with the end piece.